Hi guys, welcome to Sim Proof. Troy speaking here, and this time I'm creating a sim. Yes, I'm redoing it because I've realized that I am pretty bad at doing this. So I try to create a sim every week now to improve my sims creating. I don't know how you call the skill, but I'm pretty sure it's something like that. So um, yeah, I basically um, try to yeah, improve my skills here and get used to the options we have in the create a sim tool. So since I'm only a builder, I'm like going to do this regularly every week. I'm trying to do at least one sim. So for the guys out there who like to watch castes, that's like the short for create a sim. They can be happy now because I'm doing much more of them now and yeah, basically I just um, try to do the sims that I just want to do. So maybe I'm going to do sims that uh, I've been tagged for in challenges for example. So other YouTube simmers have like created a challenge like for um, create a vampire or create, I don't know, a plant sim or something like this. So that's what I'm going to do as well if I get tagged now. Because um, in the time before now, I basically just ignored that because I'm pretty, pretty, well, I'm not so good at that. So, um, yeah, I'm just trying to improve here. So I thought, okay, maybe I start with something that I wanted to do, especially for my game. So I create Poison Ivy from the Batman comics or cartoon series or movies, whatever. So um, I always like the character since I'm like a little girl and I always like that, you know, like a super villain that's a, basically actually a good person because she wants to save the environment. She wants to have a green planet and uh, like clean air and basically think that she is a very interesting super villain because actually she is a good person but she tries to achieve her goals by you know killing people and destroying stuff so which is considered bad of course but i always like that she is like not so bad and she's not doing it for the money or she's not doing it for revenge or something i always like that she actually was a good-hearted soul so to speak so that's what i always liked about poison ivy and yeah, um, since we have like green skin in the game, I thought this is perfect. We can really do a poison ivy. So she has to look like a femme fatale, you know, very curvy, big boobs, a little bit of butt, I would say. I think I'm not allowed to say ass. Is this a curse word? I'm not even sure. But let's just pretend I only said butt. <laughs> and uh, yeah, um, it was pretty clear I actually had to have um, green skin and red hair of course. At first I thought pink would be cool as well because we have that pink but then I found the cool alien tattoos or alien makeup in the game which is basically these little um, freckles I would say and I thought it looks a little bit like um, the pattern that's sometimes on flowers for example so I thought this is pretty cool we have to use this one and that came in red so I had uh, to do her hair in red as well. And then at the end I was like, huh, is she going to have red lipstick or green lipstick? Because red looks more seductive, but it looked a little bit weird because she has green skin. So in the end I of course chose the green lipstick and yeah, I think it looks very, very nice. And then since she is like a plant simp, sadly we, do, we don't have tattoos in the game that are like leaves or like flowers, for example. That would be really, really awesome and perfect for the sim, but yeah, I think that the alien ones are fitting as well. So I chose the lilac color. I think they're lilac or dark red. And I, yeah, I like them. They look pretty, pretty good. Or did I do them in green? Yes, yes, yes. She has green tattoos. I'm so sorry. Um, yeah, and of course she had like the sexy dress. I already um, picked that out before I even started the sim. And yeah, I thought this is like the perfect dress for Poison Ivy. And since she's like a super villain or a superhero or whatever, she has to wear gloves because gloves are pretty necessary. I hope you like her. 
I think she looks pretty sexy and you can, yeah, you, you, you know what kind of um, sim she is. I mean, you can recognize her as a poison ivy, I would think so, so, or like a sexy plant sim or something like this. So I think it fits very well to the theme. And uh, yeah, I'm really glad that it turned out so well. So, um, of course, I gave her the aspiration with the boat in the street. I have forgotten and she likes to be outdoors she is very materialistic and she is romantic of course if you like her guys and she looks stunning I really like her she looks really really beautiful and yeah if you have any more ideas what kind of sims I'm going to I have to create for you next please write them in the comment section all other requests opinions or ideas write them in the comment section below as well and I hope you had fun watching this and thank you very very much and I will see you soon. Bye bye!